Hi everybody, it's Julie. I'm here with my gift bag. So I'm gonna be making three elements using this gift bag and other items for the July Just Junk Journal Challenge. If you're interested in the challenge and the details, the video is in the description box down below. We'd love to have you. And there are prizes just for finishing your journal and posting them by the um, deadline. So yeah, it's a lot of fun. So today we are using a gift bag. And so the first thing I'm gonna wanna do is take out these, um, the ribbons. So let's go ahead and take out the little ribbons. Okay, so I have my pieces out. Now I'm looking at my, my pages and gonna get an idea of how I want to use this. Okay. I'm, I'm thinking to myself, I want that and I want that. So I am going to go ahead and I'm going to cut this one, this one out. Okay. I would be thinking, okay, so I have on one side, I'm going to be cutting it up. I think on the other side, I want to keep it um, as it is. And let's see how much, so I could have all the birds on a page, okay. And, okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and cut across this piece. So I'm, I'm gonna dissect, I'm gonna dissect the gift bag here. So, okay, so there's that. And then I'm gonna go ahead and go up this edge. So I have this. And I want the inside piece of this. Okay. So this gives me this, okay? And we can go ahead and use our cutter and straighten out our edge that we just cut. And let's see, are we inside? Yeah. So, and then we can straighten out this side as well. We'll start up here because that's, whoops, that's not the cutter. Okay, so that straightened that out. Then we'll come over here and we'll straighten out our blue and white striped. So we have this piece that we can go ahead and we can add it here, okay? And it got A messed up right here, but I can, I can do something to that. And so we're gonna go up here and mark where we'll be cutting. Looks like we're cutting straight across the inside of the ribbon holder place. A little bit 
inside the blue, okay? Okay, so there we have that. And we have a page. We can go ahead and fit this page on and turn this into a um, a border tech. The cool thing is we'll be able to put something in here if we want to. Go ahead and I'm going to glue here. I am going to go ahead and glue here and across down at the bottom. Go ahead and close this and hold it down. Okay, so you're going to have a pocket here, or a border tuck. You're going to be able to pull this over and have this here. Okay. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and put this up and let it dry. Yeah, let it dry. Okay, so next we are going to use... this one here we have this fun copper bath here let's go ahead we're gonna cut this down this side so gift bags are a fun way of getting a theme or a color into a journal okay I am going to I want this bird. Okay. And I'm going to fussy cut this bird on the branch, sort of. Okay. And so we are going to go ahead and put him on this bird bath and he is going to become a little tuck okay so let's come down here where this wire is going across Then I'm going to go ahead and glue this and if it doesn't seem to be holding I will come in and I will stitch this with my sewing machine okay so just so you know that that's that's a possibility okay. but then that will make this a little tuck spot behind the bird and a little something can go in there And I think that's really kind of fun. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and just put this saying from the wrapping paper. So I have some wrapping paper that I bought for for one thing and now I still have it, so we've been using it for all kinds of things. If you're here at the premiere, I'm waving hi and say hi to Lucy. Hi, Lucy. I want to thank you for being here today. We have a whole lot more. We've got a whole gift bag to, to take apart and turn into something. And so I would just like to invite you to a premiere if you haven't gotten to come. They are every day at 1030. We New have crafty video. Usually it's junk journaling or paper crafting. Sometimes it might be a shopping haul 
or Happy Mail. And then also, right now, while we're home, safer at home, we have the Beginner's Junk Journal series. We're working in our little golden book, and that is each weekday at 4 o'clock Pacific Standard Time. So, um, also want to remind you that the digitals in the Dear Julie Julie Etsy shop are on sale for 50% off. That is a limited time. Um, it is while we are home. So, uh, you might want to take advantage of that. And let's get back to the regular program. There's our little saying. So, that gives us our second way of using our gift bag is to fussy cut the images out of it and use them in your journal. The next way, let's go ahead and we'll stick with with this one. Okay. Um, is to make a pocket um, also or And that's using images instead of just, you know, one image. We're going to go ahead and we're going to just come down and okay, and we should be able to put this on here. You'd still be able to see the rustic birdhouse there. And this will give you a pocket. Okay, so then we'll go around the pocket. And again, if this doesn't seem to be sticking, I will be going around this with the sewing machine. And then I have one other one, and that is using, well, I actually have two, but I'm going to show you this one real quick. Okay, so taking the edge of our um, the top edge, including the little eyelets, okay, cut this piece off. I mean, you can see we've got pieces that can be tags. So I will, I'll show you a few more, a couple more things that we can do. We've got this too. Okay, so this we need to cut with our, um, with our cutter. I'm going to go ahead and let's start by cutting this straight. Okay, and then I can use that edge. It's really not... Okay. okay. And both of these, they have their... It has the, the rim the top because of these holes. Okay, so let's go ahead. We're going to put this in and we're going to cut it right under the library. Okay, so all of those. This gives us this. The little plastic thing is here. I'm going to leave it because I don't want it to rip. Okay, and this can go right here and become a pocket. But before we make it a pocket, we're going to want to go ahead and put something through our, our holes there. Okay, so we're using our our fabric that we've been using. Okay, and we'll go in one and 
up through the other one, okay? And then I'm just going to go ahead and tie this in a tag knot, just a knot, okay? Just a knot. There we go. Okay, so that gives us that, and I am going to go ahead and I'm going to cut this in on both sides. Now if you would rather have this blue side, then you can use that blue side. Sometimes that happens. <laughs> So we want this side on that, and then we're going to go ahead and put this down. And again, if we need to sew this on, we will, we will leave that option open. Okay? So here, I don't know if you can see that, but we've used the top piece of the bag here. And that leaves us with a pocket here. Okay, we're going to go ahead and cut this off at the bottom. clean this up and this can become a little note a note like a list notebook or it can just go as a little journaling spot that um, attaches to the side so there's choices with this one um, you know of course you could cut it down and make it shorter So again, you could put uh, note papers in here and then this could go into a pocket. This could go over two edges and become, well you can actually just take this and put it over and hold something here with a paper clip. We haven't done any paper clips yet for this. We have we have this that we can use and then this we still have that too okay so many things this could become a notebook you could decorate it up here add papers in and sew it closed and it could become you know a little a little notebook that is somewhere in the journal um, it could go in the binding like this and get attached to another page that was in here, maybe the map page or the ledger page. So there's lots of things that can be done with that. But I did show you um, using the, the top piece that has the eyelets in it and going ahead and making a pocket. I love that. I think that that turned out really, really cool. And then we also did okay the page there where you have now we have our tuck here okay so we'll be able to put something in here and we have a pull out page okay so we'll be able to decorate continue to decorate this and um yeah, so we have that. all this using the gift bag. Then we have this, and yeah, I think that I'm gonna have to to go ahead and we'll 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 see. It looks like it's it's staying down. So, but I might go ahead and sew this pocket on, and um, 
and then we have our little bird tuck over here as well. So, so many things you can do with your gift bag. Another thing is you could just take the piece and make a belly band as well. So on one of these pages, like this is really kind of cool down here. Um, yeah, so that could be, be a belly band as well. So I will probably continue to try and use up all of these pieces as I usually do. And so watch for whether this gets, um, gets put down with, on the sewing machine and, and his tail looks like it's going to stay. I think this is really, really fun, fun way to use a gift bag and have all of these different different ways of using it. So which one was your favorite? I would love to know. And um, I'm really glad you're here. I wanna thank you for the, taking the time to come and watch one of my videos. And um, yeah, so find something to celebrate every day. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell and have an amazing day. Talk to you later. See you tomorrow. Bye. Bye-bye.